guys, this is Production Music Live, another tutorial. In this one, we are going to have a look at the future bass shift pitching rising effect for chords. Um, so you notice over here in this chord, we are pitching up in the beginning of the chord, and we are not doing that in the synthesizer, we are doing it with Ableton effects. And uh, we are combining two effects, basically. One is the EQ8 over here, this one, and the other one is the frequency shifter, that one over here. Um, and we are applying all this on a sound coming from Serum, this uh, synthesizer by Steve Duda, and we are playing a preset out of our new preset pack for Future Bass in um, Serum, and we are playing the patch um, Swedish over here. Sounds like this. So we have a little bit of portamento in Serum activated already, but that doesn't really do the job over here. If I unselect those two effects, you don't really have this pitching. So um, let's combine two things over here. One thing that's always nice is um, taking a high cut in EQ8 and automating it a little bit up at the start. So you can see over here I have this knob automated to do something like this at the beginning of the sound. So I put in the shape of this envelope over here. And you can see how it drags up through the frequency range. And um, combining that with the frequency shifter, we are getting this pitchy effect. So if you load in the frequency shifter, it looks like this. You can take uh, those things down and um, just use the fine button over here. As I have it prepared in this one, clicking it to have a look at the envelopes over here. And you can see it's already drawn in there and we are going down quite a bit at the beginning and then we are going slightly up. If I were to exaggerate this effect it will sound like this. So quite weird effect if we do it a little more up. So you can see how it slightly goes up the frequency range if you apply this effect over here and I kind of like it this way. Let's listen to it in context. So I hope this helps. This project's actually um, a remake I made today from Sanje Take Care of You. And I tried to remake it with our D Premium sample pack, um, which takes care of the drums over here. And then I tried to remake all the sounds with our preset pack for Serum. So this bass sound, for example, over here. Um, those saw pads and, you know, um, other pads down here as well. This is a sine wave, and over here we have a couple of other pads combined with those down here. I also apply this frequency shifting effect over here. It's a little heavier, this chain, but over here you can see this effect. And then I'm using the Ableton built-in guitar pack, which comes with Suite over here, and I'm playing a couple of guitar notes with it. But I'm going to do a complete tutorial on, on how to rebuild this track in the coming days, so check the description for a link to that video in future. And also check the description for the Serum presets and some drum sounds if you're interested. Well, basically, summing up, you can achieve this pitching effect with the frequency shifter and maybe you add in the EQ as well. 
and it always helps to use the um, portamento switch of your um, respective synthesizer. Serum does that as well for chords, not only in mono mode, as um, Massive revealed over here. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Subscribe to our channel, visit our Instagram and Facebook pages and check the description for stuff and I hope to see you next time.